It's never too late to learn machine learning. In this video, which will be a little bit spontaneous, I will give you an overview of the best courses in machine learning that you can take right now. Uh, basically, both the courses that I have in mind are on Coursera, which is this amazing platform which you, where you have top institutions, best universities, best professors, and the knowledge available just on one click. So basically, just to start, two courses I have in mind. The first one is basically the whole deep learning specialization from deeplearning.ai. Uh, this is the Andrew NG platform within Coursera just for machine learning. Uh, and the second one is IBM Data Science. Uh, this is coming from IBM. This is one of the most well-known courses when it comes to more uh, data science side of machine learning. So let's start. Uh, as you can see, we're on Coursera right now with, uh, and I'm going to click on deep learning first. Uh, Deep learning is taught by Andrew NG and a couple of more instructors. Basically, uh, Andrew NG was the one who started and kickstarted the uh, Coursera platform with uh, his machine learning course, which is the first course and probably still one of the best courses to take if you just starting with machine learning. Um, so basically, the, his machine learning course, the link will be down below, uh, will allow you to grasp all the basic concepts of uh, machine learning, uh, neural networks, uh, different types of networks, uh, and basically will allow you to also program them uh, in Python. So Python is the language for uh, machine learning here, uh, as well as for doing data science with IBM Data Science. So uh, deep learning specialization as a whole, that consists of a couple of courses, and it's getting from those basic concepts to really more advanced ones on how to optimize uh, neural networks, uh, where you use neural networks, and basically different use cases. So as you can see, uh, in this specialization, uh, you're going to learn things like convolutional neural networks, recurrent neural network, LSTMs, transformers, um, and then basically uh, the most recent uh, strategies like dropout, batch norm, uh, and so on. Basically using Python and TensorFlow for making the prototyping of different neural networks much faster. Uh, Keras is the second most used library and PyTorch uh, because within the Python you have TensorFlow, Keras and uh, PyTorch for using, uh, for, for invoking neural networks and making the prototyping of them much faster. Uh, so yeah, for example, Keras allows you to basically have a couple lines of code uh, just throw off some neural network and start training and actually do that for use it for prediction which is really amazing that's why people are using python even though it's not the most optimized language but it has amazing libraries and that that's why it's it's super cool yeah so basically all of those uh, speci specialization within the deep learning actually allows you to have very practical uh, tasks to do because of course still the most important thing here is uh, to really practice code a lot and this is the way the best way to learn uh, of course there is some theory to machine learning in general and deep learning and data science and so on but actually you don't need to know that much of the probability theory or statistics uh, some basic knowledge that you should have gotten already in high school should most of the time be enough and then maybe you should learn a little bit more along the way uh, as you go deeper and deeper and deeper within the neural networks and building different models or like different statistical models as well. So for example, the first course, like th there's a couple of courses as you can see within the specialization. The first course, if I were to click it, will basically allow me to, uh, first of all, I can enroll, but if I were to click it, I will be able to also audit uh, yeah, after I log in, I will be able to audit the course. So some of the courses will be available for you for free to check just the videos. You won't be able to do the exercises. You probably won't be able to see everything, but that might be a good way to start if the course is for you. Uh, so this is pretty nice. Uh, the first course is really uh, just the basis of the, the, the basics of the building neural networks. So yeah, so you have 19 videos just about uh, basics basics of the basics things like binary classification logistic regression descent uh, basically everything about how what consist what neural networks consists of uh, which is really great then you have some some kind of reading and then there's a practical uh, pract practical exercise that you'll be able to do at the very end uh, 
Then going from shallow neural networks to deep neural networks. Uh, so just a quick note, deep neural networks are basically just networks who have more than three layers. Uh, that's the most common definition, I think, or, or five, depending on probably the context. But basically, uh, deep in machine learning uh, just uh, refers to the number of layers that the neural network has. Uh, so this is, this is it for the deep learning. Uh, deep learning is basically machine learning with more layers and more complexity to it. Uh, so this is, the, this is the course for the neural networks. Uh, then if you were to sh look for the Andrew NG course, uh, you have this uh, general machine learning uh, specialization. Uh, so again, this is the speci specialization I was talking about. This is the, 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 a little bit more basic and it's going much slower th than the deep learning specialization itself. Uh, and this is the, the, the thing that the Andrew NG started Coursera uh, basically, and the cool thing here is that it's basically the, the newest edition. So just this year, uh, the whole course got updated with the new tools, uh, the new exercises and so on. So going into the machine learning specialization will actually allow you to get the most up to date knowledge right now. So this is really cool. As you can see, the, uh, there are a couple of courses. Again, if I were to go into um, basic course number one, then the material for that will be uh, some of the things you have seen already in the deep learning specialization that I've started with, uh, but it, it's much slower. So you have each week is basically what uh, wa some of the concepts of the, the deep learning specialization talk about in which we in one week. This is like a couple of weeks here in machine learning. Uh, so if you haven't done any machine learning before, this is probably the course for you. Also, uh, because it's really just fantastic. It's really a classic. It's, it's the first massive course that was taught online at this scale. So it's already uh, good to know. Also, if you don't feel like if you did some machine learning, but you don't feel confident, this might be also a good way to start. Another thing that I wanted to mention is this IBM data science course uh, that I've mentioned before, uh, because this is uh, another specialization that is really great, especially if you're looking to go more on the number side. So you're still interested in machine learning, but you want uh, to be as well versed in, for example, statistics. Uh, but currently data science and machine learning are mixed so, so much that it doesn't really matter. Uh, IBM data science is really more for the even more basic than the, the machine learning course itself by, by Andrew NG. Uh, this is the course for people who have probably got some experience in Python, but still, uh, if you look at the syllabus, the very first course will be uh, about, uh, about Python. It will teach you everything about things like Jupyter Notebooks, Jupyter Lab, and uh, stuff like that. And only later on, it will start using Python for, for doing data science. So uh, as you can see, it's much slower uh, in pace. Uh, also to mention, uh, the course by Andrew and G, the machine learning one, will also start by, uh, invoking some mathematics first and only later on you will be able to code that mathematics into actual neural networks. Uh, so summing up, you have basically, well, two, three specializations I mentioned two in the beginning, uh, but two are coming from Andrew NG. Uh, one is uh, more basic, this is the machine learning specialization. One is more advanced, that, that's the deep learning specialization. And then you have the, the specialization by IBM, IBM Data Science. All together, all those three specializations are uh, really my favorite one, uh, ones when it comes to learning, machine learning slash data science, uh, because they are just great. They are tested by thousands and thousands of people. They are also constantly improved. Uh, as you can see, for example, the rate, there are like 56,000 ratings and the, the average is 4.6, which is just insane. This is like the, it's, it's really hard to see so many people agreeing on the fact that this is a great course. So if you want to also check, check more things like that, just go to like Bros Data Science or Bros Machine Learning uh, to see what Coursera has to offer because Coursera has this also program called Coursera Plus, which basically is like Netflix, but for courses online. And then you can pick and choose. You just pay once, uh, I think once a month or annually, and you'll be able to go through any course you wish. Uh, basically, you just check for details. I, I think maybe deep learning specialization is not included, it ha you, you should check for that. Uh, nevertheless, I will give you the link to everything down below to all the free specializations plus 
uh, Coursera Plus. Let me know what you think about it. I will uh, definitely want to record more videos about different courses on Coursera as well in the near future related to data science and machine learning uh, because I think this is a fascinating subject and it's worth going into it right now if you want to pick new skills or if you want to develop your uh, software engineering career. Thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next episode.